In this video, I'm going to show you a really effective man and zone blitz beater out of the trips tight end formation in Madden 23. Now, if you want to learn how I run trips tight end, I'd really encourage you uh, to consider getting my trips tight end offensive ebook. Uh, you can do so by clicking the link down in the description below. Uh, it's only $10 to become a Patreon member, and you get access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. So, if you want to check that out, again, the link is down in the description. But we're taking a look here today um, at really one of my favorite little concepts as of late because of what the current meta is in this game. The current meta in 923 is kind of shifting into a zone blitz, man blitz meta. Um, it's really been a man blitz meta, meta for the majority of the year, but now you're getting a lot more zone blitzes out of dollar or even just out of any formation. And so we're going to show you one of my favorite ways to attack it. The play is the New England Patriots playbook. And we're taking a look today at the play Pats Y in. So how are we going to attack this meta or this cover zero um, or even this, um, you know, the zone blitz meta as well that is kind of forming. So we're going to first show this to you against the Mike Blitz Zero Blitz uh, right here. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to put our slot receiver on a flat. We're going to put our tight end on a crosser. We're going to wheel our running back. And then if you want to, you can take this outside player and you can leave him on this post or you could put him on a streak. And you're just going to motion this flat receiver across the formation and you're going to snap the ball right about here. What you're going to see is this is going to out leverage the man coverage and we're going to be able to attack the man blitz that way with that quick flat. Now the beauty of this is this is also, if they are in a man blitz scenario, this is going to leave our other routes open as quick reads. If you have the short in elite ability on your player, um, on this player right here or the tight end, either one of these guys, you're going to get open really quickly. So you'll see here, if I see the user go to the right side of the screen, I'm going to try to hit this little speed out right here. And we're going to try to turn that up and get as many yards as possible against the man blitz. Now, if they're going to be zone blitzing you out of this, I'll show you what that might look like. Um, you know, so here again, this is just a basic zone uh, zone blitz. Let me actually check into this and then back into the man coverage so that we can get a little bit more accurate representation. But let's say that they are, um, you know, going to send a zone blitz with a hard flat on this side. It's the same basic idea. They're trying to use her this middle of the field. And what you have in this formation is you have the ability to attack um, in a variety of different ways. So again, with this quick flat, with this crosser, what you'll see is if it's a zone blitz, again, your first read is going to be this running back on this wheel route right here. You're going to force them to have to go user defend. Um, you're going to force them to have to go and user defend that player. Okay, so again, we'll show you this now from a cover. Um, let's say that they go to the running back side. Then what you're going to notice is your tight end on this crosser is going to get you know pretty good separation. So you see here, this is kind of what your setup looks like. You're going to highball this crosser right into that little area. I don't know how he. I think it's because Mahomes is high throw dead eye actually messed up because it's a glitched ability. Um, but what you'll see here again is if I user the running back, then it leaves open this tight end on this quick flat. Um, it could potentially leave open the post deep down the field. Um, you know, you'll see right here. But really, this is a great little just quick reads uh, against the man in zone blitz. So they run to the running back. So now I'm just going to throw that ball right into that little alley that is now vacated over the middle of the field. So very simple way to beat the man in zone blitz meta without having to block people, right? We're able to send five out and be able to attack the defense in a variety of ways. Now, the next little piece of this is how do you attack, you know, maybe coverage defense, for example. Really, it's no different. Um, this flat is going to pull out the zones, and you should be able to throw this wheel um, with a high ball kind of right in here, and you're going to make that little catch right there with your running back. So you have a lot of value with this. Now, if they were to run more of a man coverage, that's where we want to work our crosser. We want to work our out route. We want to work our uh, post route. Those are the main reads against man. Now, sometimes this running back will get open, but you see like right here, um, see how sometimes the running back will actually get over the top of the man coverage. If you have a taller running back, he won't dumb out like that. Um, you know, but you have that ability as well against main coverage to try to hit this this running back uh, on the wheel. So this is one of my favorite plays because I think it spaces the field really well. It kind of attacks every angle um, of the field. And then you also have this tight end crosser that is pretty good against man if you have short and elite. 
Um, and then you also have this out route. Again, short and elite makes everything more open against man. Um, you know, short and elite on everybody. This out route here, you see, pass lead that outside, very effective against the man coverage. So this is one of my favorite plays for really any defense right now. Uh, I think the wheel routes are certainly back. If you want to learn how to throw these wheel routes, in our Patreon, we talk a little bit about how to throw these at a really high level. But this little catch right there is actually really consistent, and we teach how to do that in the Patreon. I want to thank you for watching the video. If you want to get my entire Trips Tied In offensive ebook, make sure that you join our Patreon. The link is down in the description. It's only $10 to become a member there, and that's where you'll get access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. Thanks for watching the video, and we hope to see you guys over at the Patreon page.